Hey guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and today I'm going to show you how to draw a water drop in Adobe Illustrator. And if you're interested, please keep watching. This is size of my workspace and these are colors which I'm going to use in my tutorial. And now let's start to draw. If you're a beginner in Adobe Illustrator, please start from that video. In that video you will find a free 30 days plan in Adobe Illustrator where you will find 30 different tutorials with tasks and you can try yourself with different styles and to understand do you like to be a graphic designer and do you want to have a graphic design career. My workspace is ready and colors are already in the swatches panel. Let's take green color and rectangle tool and create background. Now let's take gray color and ellipse tool. Hold shift, create the circle and select that point with direct selection tool and move it a little up. Okay. Now hold Alt and make the copy, bring the original to front. Now select the copy, make it with white color, select both shapes, take blend tool, select the first shape and now the second. OK. Now go to opacity multiply. Now select direct selection tool, select the original, copy and paste it. OK. Now move it here. Now select the shape, go to object, create gradient mesh here free to free and take white color move the color straight to these points okay now go to opacity overlay okay now let's add highlights let's take ellipse tool create the ellipse now we need to take gradient from white to black. Here we need white color, here black color. OK, now let's take gradient tool, move the gradient like this, squeeze it a little. OK, now move the slider a little bring it a little up okay it's ready now go to opacity screen okay now make it a little wider okay now select copy and paste it rotate and put it here, play a little with the slider and take gradient tool, bring a little down like that. OK, make it a little wider. Move a little up, copy and paste it. Now make the copy smaller like that. OK, it's ready. Now take ellipse tool and radial gradient. Move the slider like this. OK. Now gradient tool, squeeze it a little. And put here opacity screen okay rotate one of the copy here make it a little bigger put here and make the copy the second copy here okay play a little with that gradient 
OK, it's ready. Now let's add one more highlight. Let's take ellipse tool. Create the ellipse like this. Take black color. Now make it a little smaller. Make it wider like that. Change fill to stroke. Take pen tool. Draw here the line straight to the drop. And here can be ugly. Now change here stroke to fill and the same stroke to fill. Select both shapes. Shape Builder tool. Hold Alt and delete unwanted parts. Now let's select this corner and that one and round corners. If you have here the copy deleted. OK, we need the shape like this. Now take the mesh tool at the point here. OK, now take green color at here green, green color. Now um, here change opacity to screen. OK, and let's add some points with mesh tool here and in that place and in that place. OK, now it's better. And now let's add the text water drop and let's select the font create outlines now bring it here now bring the water drop to front okay put the text here and make it with white color. OK. Now make it bigger a little. Let's move water drop here. Make it a little smaller. OK. If you like, you can copy and paste that shape and here opacity multiply. And you can change transparency to 50, for example, to make water drop a little darker. But it's if you want it. Let's ungroup the text, move the water here, select the whole design and put it to the center. It's ready, guys. Hope you like my tutorial. If yes, give me a like and subscribe. And see you in the next tutorials in Adobe Illustrator or in the next videos in graphic design.